Hey, what's to you too, fam? It's your girl, TK, and I'm in my car vlogging, and um, it's like 100 degrees out, and I was like, you know what? I got some time, so while I'm sitting here, I want to do a video on Solange Knows. Now, one of the things that I love and admire about Solange is that she's going to show respect to her big sister. That's Beyonce Knows Carter, and as a matter of fact, she went on Twitter to show a little bit of support for not only Beyonce, but Blue Ivy, her niece, and I thought it was hella adorable. So I wanted to read this article. It's coming from Billboard. And it says here, Solange shows love to Beyonce and Blue Ivy after DC's Renaissance shows forever and all. That is really cute. One of the things I want you guys to note here is that, you know, you never really hear about any, like, you know, fights that's going on with Beyonce and Solange. It seems like they have this perfect relationship throughout the years. And honey, me and my sisters, we fight, we we uh, we laugh, we cry, but that's a part of being a sibling. Nothing is ever so perfect, but when I see a perfect sister, I want to know more. So um, let's talk about it. So it says here that the Grammy winner shouted out her older sister and niece on her Instagram stories Saturday night, August 5th. I thought it was cute. And also, I want you guys to know, I don't know if y'all can see because my phone is all messed up. But there's a picture of Solange and Beyonce, which I'm going to um, make my um, thumbnail so y'all can see what Billboard is speaking of when they are talking about this beautiful relationship, this sister-sister type of relationship. I like it. Anyhow, let's go forward. It says Saturday night, August 5th, Beyonce's Washington, D.C. Renaissance World Tour style was a true family affair. In a loving show of support for her older sister and niece, Blue Ivy, Solange took to her Instagram to show them some love for their sizzling performance. That's my sister, y'all. And of course, as I'm reading it, a commercial wants to come up. So let me start that over. It says, that's my sister, y'all, forever in awe. Solange excitedly captioned a clip of Beyonce singing her cover of Frank Frankie Beverly and Mays Before I Let Go, which peaked at number 65 on the Billboard Hot 100. The Grammy-winning Cranes and the Sky singer also made sure to show some love to her eldest niece, Grammy-winning singer and dancer Blue Ivy Carter. Address me as Blue's auntie only, Solange declared in a caption of a clip of Queen Bee's eldest daughter dancing to Black Parade, which topped out at number 37 on the Hot 100. Mmm. So Solange attended the first of Beyonce's two Washington, D.C. shows at last night's um, show. Beyonce paid a $100,000 fee to keep the D.C. Metro open an extra hour after severe weather significantly delayed the start of her show. So I thought it was in Maryland that the um, delay happened and she had, um, with, when I say the delay, there was weather issues. And so I'm thinking that happened in Maryland, but it was actually Washington, D.C. So I need to correct my other video that I just got done doing because I had the locations a little bit wrong. But hell, you know what, Miss Beyonce, she's just hopping around like all over the place. Like she's a straight whore. She got a Liz Cox open. She's in no strange men's. You know what I'm saying? She's a whole married woman out here in these streets. And she says she wants to go missing with her um, daughters right there. You know, child please. I can't keep up with all this shit. It's a lot to be keeping up with when it comes to Beyonce and her and her whorish vibes. But it's really cute to know that Miss... Um, um, Solange is out here showing support to all this um, um, appearance of human trafficking. It's cute. I like to see a sister who has a perfect relationship, even though I don't know any sister that ever had one that was perfect. But it's really nice that they can come across as being real perfect. Me and my sisters, we can never. But we love each other. But we will check each other in a minute. But we will never come across as perfect. You better believe it. They'll tell you. I don't trust. They'll tell you. Shit ain't perfect over here. And it won't be. It will not be. We gonna argue. We gonna fight. We gonna cry. We might say we love each other. But at the end of the day, we gonna be sisters. You know? You don't really see that with Beyonce and Solange. Everything is always so perfect. Except that one time on the elevator scene. And bitch, I'm tired of that. Y'all need to give us something new at this point. Okay, well, I guess Beyonce knew it. Newness will be the whore. 
the whore that's coming out of her now this renaissance which means rebirth um and she's being a queen but her queendom is attached to whoring you know and that's a thriller but it's a beautiful it's a beautiful article and if you have a chance you should check out the billboards article i think it's very much so a thriller it's interesting you know you may like it anyhow peace love and happiness guys i wanted to share that article and i did so i'm gonna go Bye.